once again welcome to ahoy navigos we are once again back with the chart work concepts today we are going to discuss about horizontal sextant angle that's the concept what we have today let us see to the points what are important when we are considering these types of problems first point is all the bearings should be at the same time this means that it's a simultaneous fix second point heading of the ship will not be given this means is an indication to understand these types of problems are horizontal sextant angle types of problem other thing this is a kind of simultaneous fix that we already told this all bearings are at the same time this is what is called simultaneous fix next point is compass error can be obtained from this calculation this is the only method where we can obtain your compass error they will be giving the bearing sometimes in your compass or gyro but to convert that you need the variation and deviation and you don't have the heading so we will not be getting deviation so we have to proceed with the bearing that they have given and we have to solve the problem and we'll be obtaining the compass error the next point is we need at least two position circle or one position circle and one position line or two position line to do an hsa this means that we will be requiring for a fix we will be requiring two things at least either two position circles or one position circle and one position line or two position lines will you will get to know about it when we do the problems here we are going to discuss in this thing there are total five cases for horizontal sextant angles let us go for the first case this is the case one case one is that this is when your theta is less than 90 degrees i will explain you what is theta and how it is calculated and these types of problems hsa should never be greater than 180 degrees this is an important thing you should be having it in your mind so let us take an example of a lighthouse a bearing 330 compass and a lighthouse b bearing 030 compass in most of the chart work problems you will be always required to convert the compass into true to do the problem on a chart but in this case of hsa thing you never need to convert into true you have to convert but you will not be getting uh, how to convert because you don't know the heading so you will not be getting the deviation you will only have the variation in the question so you will not be getting the true bearing so what we do is we will just take the bearing in compass what they have given and we will solve the problem we will find the what is the compass error most of the question they will be asking what is the compass error also so let us see how we will be doing so suppose this is zero 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 degree I'm just here explaining you how to calculate theta, and you have another one that is three 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 zero degrees. That's our next bearing, and we have the third bearing zero three zero. So from this we need to calculate what is theta. Theta will be nothing but this this angle, and uh, that angle you can see it is sixty degree in this case three three zero 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 and zero three zero thirty degree here and thirty degree here. So that is sixty degrees. So from this next thing what we need to calculate is theta we got that's 60 degrees next thing what we need to calculate is alpha this is an important concept in hsa how this alpha is calculated that is alpha is nothing but 90 degree minus your theta so in this case this is 90 minus 60 that is 30 degrees so that is what we found now and let us now get into the chart suppose these are two lighthouses we have lighthouse a and lighthouse b and the bearings we have so what thing we need to do is that we need to just join these two lighthouses with a straight line next thing is that we need to draw your alpha 30 degrees with respect to these line joining a and b on the side of the ship so this will be one thing like this and this thing like this that means these angles are 30 degrees you need to take your protractor or something and you can measure this 30 degree and this is 30 degree here and this 30 degree here and as you know this is a triangle equilateral triangle and the sum of the angles will be 180 degrees since we have 30 and 30 degrees your hs angle will be 120 degrees so we got that next thing what we need to do is that we need to draw a circle with center c joining these two lighthouses so 
will be like this something like this so c is the center and we join these two lines so from hsa of these two lighthouses we got your position circle this is what we found using your hsa thing and uh, if you need to find the compass error you should get a fix also we discussed in the previous thing that if you want a fix you should have at least two position circles two position lines or one position circle and one position line so in this case you have only one position circle and if you want to i will let's say i'll just explain you with an additional lighthouse in most of the hsa question they'll be giving three bearings at least three bearings should be there to do a fix so for example let us take one more lighthouse like this we have a lighthouse here so the similar way we need to join b and the next lighthouse and we have the angle the similar way we calculate the alpha and we got the two angles there suppose this also the same 30 degrees and 30 degrees and you have c as a center now the same thing you have to draw another circle as c as a center joining b and your next lighthouse so that will be somewhat like this so from this type of thing you now have two fixes the one fix is on the lighthouse so that will never be your fix for sure so the only way is that this is your fix so this is nothing but this is your fix so your fix is this one this is your fix this is nothing but your fix so this is how you do these kinds of problem in the following cases we will not be explaining with fix we will be only explaining till how we will get the position circles using the hsa if you have the other bearings you can proceed with the same any of the cases there can be questions like first two lighthouses having case one theta less than 90 and the second two lighthouses having another cases so we will be uh, explaining about those things in another uh, another cases so let us go to now next case that is case number two this is case number two and in this you have the theta greater than 90 degrees so for example we have taken we have a lighthouse a bearing 030 degrees and a lighthouse bearing 150 degrees so let's calculate what is the theta suppose this is your 000 degrees so this will be your 030 degrees first bearing and the second one will be 150 degrees somewhat like this so your theta will be between this 030 and 150 there is nothing but 120 degrees nothing but 150 minus 030 it's pretty straightforward one to zero degrees so the next thing what we need to do is we need to calculate what is alpha so you know theta is 120 degrees so alpha is nothing but 90 minus theta in this case it's greater than 90 it is negative that is minus 30 so there is a significance for this negative value so let us get into it and know what is this negative value this negative sign indicates alpha is to be drawn or drawn on the opposite side so i will explain you how to do this we will do with the example so you will get a better idea suppose this is two lighthouses lighthouse a lighthouse b and the similar way we join these two lighthouses next thing what we need to do is we need to draw your alpha if the alpha was positive we should have drawn it in the c side normally this is your c side and this is a land sign when you're doing in the chart if it's positive you should be drawing towards the ship on the sea side and since it is negative we need to draw on the other side so it will be like somewhat like this you have two alphas that is c as a center you have this one 30 degrees they want this one 30 degrees this is how the negative influence your problem it will be coming on the opposite side of your ship normally if the ship is here the sea side the line side you will be doing the alphas and you have so you have the similar thing 30 degrees 30 degrees and 120 degrees you'll be having here so similar way c as the center you need to draw a circle like this so this is c as the center you draw two circles you have the position circle and most of the case they will be giving one more lighthouses that's the only way you can give take a fix if they are asking only to normally they don't ask um, you to only find the position circles they will be asking you to find fix so they will be giving one more lighthouse here i'm just explaining in the similar uh, in the previous case there should be we just explained with the three lighthouses 
so the first lighthouse they may they may be having the first case and the between the second and third lighthouse uh, may have this negative sign so don't get confused you will get anyway you will be getting two position circles and you will get a fix so we'll be explaining the other three cases in another video so stay tuned i hope you guys enjoyed have a good day this is ahoy navigo signing off thank you